Hello and welcome to Salt Nation TV. I'm doing that again. Hello and welcome to Salt Nation TV. In this episode, well, it's an episode about the cube. Oh, what's happened? <gasps> New wheel reveal time. So Ed, yeah. I've got new wheels, haven't I? You have got new wheels. Unless, just before I show them, what's your opinion of them? I love them to bits. You do, don't you? Yeah. They are. I do love wheels. They're stunning, <laughs> and the thing is, they weren't. They weren't my first choice initially. Ooh. But, well, I, I basically I went for a, a set of wheels. They sent them, and they were going to be too big. And then I went for these, and I'm more than happy. I love them so much. They're and we so know nice. We've had this star before. Both of us had the star before. Yeah. Um, you had them on your Mini. Yeah. I had them on my CRX. Yes, you had them on the CRX. The so they suit this car down to T. And what are they? Rotor, Rotor RBs. RBs. Now, RB, eh? they are stunning. Um, I'm blown away with just how good they look. So the wheels I originally went for were Japan Racing JR6s, oh, you like, you like um, which are similar to that. Yeah. Um, but I ordered them in a 16 by 8 with an offset of 25. Um, and I, as soon as I took one out of the box, I looked at it and just went, nah, it's not going to fit. I'm going to have issues with this arch particularly so i sent them back thank you i've got to say a big thank you to driftworks who i bought oh, the wheels yeah, from yeah, yeah. um i've also bought a boss kit for the cube from them as well but um it was an easy process to send them back you know they obviously weren't damaged i sent them back yeah they got these out to me uh direct from rotor nice so um 15 by 7 yeah oh, seven's perfect isn't it offset of 30 30. And I mean, you know, what is it normally on these? They've only uh, 50. Is it okay? So look at that. I mean, it's a great stance. It looks stunning. I went for Falcon tires. I'm a big fan of Falcon no, tires. No. I've run them on a few, um, a few cars. Sorry, I was burping in my mouth there. But it just, I mean, you know, the tires are fresh on. Like the wheels are fresh on. They've they only went on earlier this week. Well, week this week at time of filming, um, but. It's, I mean, they are stunning. I love them. What um, GDM will, are they mimicking? In particular? Uh, there's those. Fan racing, they mimic classic. Um, well, there's those, those alloys, mini they? lights and ultra lights and yeah, all that sort of yeah, stuff. Yeah, it is like a mini, yeah. I think it's ultra light. Is that is the it? Japanese might version? Be, might be. But, Don't know. but I mean, it amazing. just, look at how that car looks. I mean, I think it's a stunning looking car. And just. Just look at how stunning that is. They're better than the all chrome ones you had on before. Oh, definitely. And keeping the chrome lip, it was a really good shout. Yeah. A really good shout. I just, it just blends in perfectly. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I've got my stickers there. Yeah. You know, oh, Super Square, one of our sponsors with XO Racing, our main channel sponsor. Um, so lots more content coming on the cube. But I mean, I'm blown away. I just think it looks absolutely amazing. Um, I've, it's a cherry, mate, isn't it? It's a cherry on top of a lovely white... Without being arrogant, sponge. I think I'm quite good at picking wheels. You are. And you I, are. these okay. definitely suit what I was... This this is better than I hoped for, to be honest. And I love Rotor RVs, so 
you know. Arby's. Arby's. <laughs> Arby's. Um, and the car, and you'll see this in a later video, um, but the way this has changed the dynamic of the car it, when you're driving it is incredible. Um, you know, the wheels that are on it, the Ortec um, ones, yeah. they're lovely wheels, but they're 15 by five and a half, which is way too short. That, I mean, it's way too narrow. Mm. Um, especially because I like driving this car a little bit quick at times. And then, you know, it's my daily. I like to enjoy it as well as sort of being practical and fine with it. And um, like it just, since putting wider wheels on, like a 7J rather than a five and a half, I'm noticing a little bit more, obviously a little bit more grip. But it there's le it feels like there's less body roll. I mean, the car's lowered anyway. Well, it's, it's on springs. Now, isn't it? But yeah, it's just you know, not only does it look amazing, but they serve a practical purpose as well. Are you selling the um, other wheels? Yes. Are they on marketplace yet? Not yet. No, it I will be at time of release a video. Probably. Yeah. I mean, I did have a guy from the uh, Cube Owners Group contact me regarding the wheels yeah. um, because because you know I mentioned I asked a question about whether. 16 by 8 is a good move after I'd already ordered them. Mm. And, um, <laughs> and he went 15, no, 15 by 7. Yeah, well, no, that guy didn't. Nobody really answered that question oh, really particularly not. well. They did all right. I mean, you know, people were like, just give it a go. And there were some really nice pictures put up, which was nice. And the actual vibe of that group is really nice. Um, not as It's not as cool as the Super Square group, but you've got to be, you know, exclusive JDM only boxcar sort of to be on there. Uh, unless you're Ed and then... Ed can go on there because the channel's sponsored by Super Square. There's but no chance we get a box at this stage. No, one day soon though. Maybe. But yeah, just generally, I mean, I'm going to sell them probably 200, 250 quid. Oh, okay. um, They've got new tyres on. So, you know, the RBs are staying. They're not going anywhere. And I know that there'll be some purists. There always are going, well, it's the Autec Rider version. You should have kept it all Autec. I should, maybe I should have. Maybe. But it's my car. And I modify cars, and I enjoy doing that. And these look fucking amazing. And who has all chrome wheels anymore? Uh, no one. Yeah, exactly. I mean, you've got to remember I see, I see this car. This is this is the the final sort of few months that Z11s were made. This is 2008, the yeah. start of 2008. This was put in production, or this was made. That's when chrome wheels went. Themed. Yeah, it, it's 2022, guys. Yeah. You know, it's like I don't mind a bit of chrome. I think the chrome on the front looks excellent. But full chrome wheels, they're not for me. I like a little bit of chrome, well, and that's what I've gone for. Exactly. Now match it it match echoes right. it. Do you want, and actually, too much chrome on white. Yeah. I don't know. Well, do you know what my that. brother said, right? My what? brother Nick, and I, I, I love both my brothers dearly, but Nick went, oh, I've got to get chrome uh, wing mirrors now. No. No. No, no, I don't. I'll leave them white unless I decide to go, let's go de chrome and put all the chrome black. And then I might go for black wing mirrors. But even then, I'm not going to do that. I like the no, chrome. I like, I'll leave it the way it is. The way this looks is immense. And, you know, the modifications that will be going on to this cube are mainly going to be aesthetic. There's not much, too much body aesthetic you can do anymore. No. Well, you know, more stickers, obviously, because that's what we'll happens. Get that little dent sorted. Yeah, there's a teeny little dent up there. Can they do little spoilers for these? Yeah, you can get an impulse spoiler. So that'll probably be going on there. Yeah. Um, um, exhaust system. I don't know what... It's already got the lovely body kit though, hasn't it? That's it. And some proper coilovers. And that'll be, that. you know, I mean, it won't be finished, but that'll be, you know, there may be some interior stuff. But the interior is stunning. I mean, I've got stuff in here at the moment, like the car seat, but... And some... That's from another video that will be out after this because uh, that was a bit of a fail that ended up being great. But, um, <laughs> you know, I got what I wanted with this car. I wanted the long wheelbase. I wanted the uh, I wanted the Autec Rider version, and yeah. I wanted a Z11, you and got, I got I got, got it. Yeah. Or Sam. All of that JDM goodness, like the uh, GPS there that you can't use because we're not in Japan. Um, and I bet these are as well. These um, wind deflectors. Oh yeah. J proper JDM. They are yeah. But yeah, so man, yeah, I love them. And you kept the dice. Yeah. Oh yeah. Shout out to the previous owner. JDM Dice. JDM Dice. Right. And the, Rice. to be fair, um, he also had, uh, had like bits that he left in this car, the previous owner. And um, they're I'm, now in your car. They're in my car, so, so I'm benefiting as well. 
Are you going to change the lug nuts? Not yet, because I quite like the finish on those. But I want to go for some XO Racing purple ones. Because it's well, very, it, uh, very sulky. Your um, old Prelude one. Oh, you've got them on the Prelude. No, I haven't oh, got no, Prelude. Be different. No, on the uh, Accord, that colour. Yeah, I want to get... I think the purple ones will but fit. It won't be the same size, though, will it? No, you'd have to get a different size. Yeah. Like a 1.5, is it? Or 1. Yeah, 25? something like that. 1.25, I think. Who so, knows? So you only need uh, 20. Yeah. No, you don't. 16. 16, yeah. <laughs> Good maths there, Ed. <laughs> anyway, we hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, then yeah. please, please, please subscribe. Turn on notifications and, you know, join the party. <laughs> <laughs> and until the next time, I've been me, you've been you, Ed's been Ed, and uh, well done for that. RB. <laughs> RB. Well, RB, eh? Well, RB. You wrote your RB. Look at those. Nice. Mm -hmm.